Today I'm going to be diving even deeper into Windows 7 with the inclusion of Windows Live Family Safety. You might be thinking to yourself, uh, what's that? I use Windows 7, I use parental controls, I should know what that is, and you should. Windows Live Family Safety takes parental controls to the next level. Here, I'll show you what I'm talking about. Windows Live Family Safety is a great tool inside of the Windows Live Essentials Pack that's for free that simply takes your parental controls to the next level. So if you don't have it, you can simply go to Microsoft.com and if you have Windows 7, you can download the Windows Live Essentials Pack and included inside of that is Windows Live Family Safety. What Windows Live Family Safety is used for is for managing other accounts. It simply gives you more control of what that account is allowed to do and you can also view their activities. Examples of what you can do with it is web filtering, as far as what websites the account is allowed to visit, also filtering lists where you can allow or deny specific websites, activity reporting where you can see all the activity on the account as far as the websites they've viewed and how many visits they've had per site. There's also contact management which simply includes all the accounts, chats, shares, and emails. There's also requests and this is where you'll see a request for instance if there's a website that the account wants to view they can send you a request and you can allow it or deny it from here. It also gives you the ability to have time limits on when the account's allowed to be used, game restrictions based off of the game's rating, and program restrictions as well. So Windows Live Family Safety gives you quite a bit of information on the account and also gives you quite a bit of control over that account. And as well as that, you can add Windows Live Family Safety to multiple computers. And there you go, that's a basic overview of everything you can do inside of Windows Live Family Safety. Throughout this course, I'll be showing you more in depth of how to use each feature inside of Windows Live Family Safety. So if you'd like to stay connected to this learning course, make sure to subscribe and feel free to rate and comment below. And thanks for watching.